A transgender cheerleader is facing assault charges after allegedly choking a 17-year-old girl. Let's break this down. <music> Greetings and salutations, everybody. and Welcome back to The Fumble. I'm your host, Jackie Ray, or Jackie Ray TV, if you want to follow me on YouTube, Instagram, or Twitter. But before you do that, you know the drill. Please make sure you hit that subscribe button and that notification bell. Now, let me just say, I always, I always clown y'all for just reading the title of the video, not actually watching it, and coming to some sort of conclusion without all the details. But feel free to clown me, because I did the exact same thing, but in reverse. I read the first paragraph of this story that said a transgender cheerleader choked a young girl who ended up hiding in the closet and calling her dad to come help. Dad pulls up and threatens to beat the brakes off of anyone who touches his daughter. That is all I read. And then I saw this video, which I initially thought was a dad trying to convince young girls to open up the door so they could catch these hands. And I was instantly appalled. The door. Okay, Courtney, first of all, um, you need to calm down because um, who are you talking to? Okay. But I was wrong. That video was posted by Avery Chanel Metlock, a cheerleader who identifies as a transgender woman. Metlock talked about the incident on social media saying, well guys, I'm officially retired as a cheerleader as of last night at 5.30 a.m. A girl on the team was being disrespectful and told me I am a man with a penis and that guy should not be on the team. First of all, let's take a look at some professional cheerleading competitions, shall we? Guys, guys, oh look, more guys. So if the 17 year old did say that, then she obviously doesn't know much about cheerleading at all. Medlock told us more about the situation saying, quote, I stood up for myself and she called her mom and dad because she was scared because I stood up for myself. Her father said she still has testosterone and a penis and I will kill anyone who comes after my daughter. Mm, not entirely mad if the dad said that because his daughter is 17. Medlock is 25. And what dad is going to let any grown adult put their hands on his daughter, especially one who clearly has a size and strength advantage. Medlock also said the dad made racist remarks, but he denied that saying, quote, I ask you what you would have done when receiving a phone call at one o'clock in the morning from your daughter stating they had locked themselves in a room with other girls after this person said you want to fight and proceeded to put their hands around my daughter's neck. I don't know about the racist remark, but the daughter definitely called Metlock a dude. Okay, well, outside then. You're a man. I'm not a man. It's uh -huh. all a girl. My, my license uh -huh. is not a female, baby. This whole thing is a mess, but the biggest question for me is, why is a 25 year old on the same team as a 17 year old? At that point, no, we are not the same. We have nothing in common. But let me know your thoughts about this one in the comments below. Once again, I'm Jackie Rain. Thanks for watching The Fumble.